The Wall Street Journal recently reported that thieves are stealing iPhones, and within minutes, they are locking people out of their Apple account. When that happens, the iPhone user can't reach any of their photos, videos, or documents on any device because they can't log into their Apple account. Hi, this is John Grubb from 4kcc.com. In this video, I'm going to show you what you need to do on your iPhone right now, today, to prevent this from happening. If your phone is ever stolen or lost, this will prevent anyone from changing your information. Let's get started. First on your iPhone, let's go to Settings. When you're in Settings, scroll to where you see Screen Time. Tap on Screen Time. If your screen time is not turned on, this is where you need to turn it on. If it's already turned on, you'll be able to skip to the next step. But for right now, let's turn on the screen time. So I'm going to tap on that, and it gives me a little synopsis of what you can do with screen time. And once again, I'm going to tap on Turn on Screen Time. Now it asks me, is this my iPhone or is it my child's? Uh, so this is my phone, so I'm going to tap on that. And near the bottom, we want to tap on Use Screen Time Passcode. So I'm going to tap on that. And it's going to ask me to create a passcode. Make sure you don't use the same passcode that you use to log onto the phone. So I'm going to put one in. And now it's going to ask me to confirm it. So I've confirmed it. Now I need to log in with my Apple ID. Once I've put the ID in, I click on OK. And now it will ask me for the password. And once I have the password in, again, in the upper right-hand corner, I tap OK. Now on the screen time window, go down to content and privacy restrictions and tap on that. At the top of the content and privacy restrictions window, turn on the option. Once you flip that switch to the right and turn that on, you'll need to enter the new passcode that you just created. And once you do that, you can continue. We're going to scroll down Pass Privacy to Allow Changes. At this point, where it says Account Changes, you see the word Allow to the right of that. We'll tap on that, and now we'll tap Don't Allow, and use the back at the top left. And you can see now under Account Changes, Don't Allow. We have one more change to make. Where it says Passcode Changes, tap on Allow, change it to Don't Allow, Hit the back, and now just back up to the original settings by using the arrow in the upper left-hand corner. And now I'm back to my original settings. If you look at the very top where your account is, in my case you see my picture and my name, that is now grayed out. If I try to tap on that to make changes, I cannot do it. The only way I could make changes is to go into screen time, put my code in, and then revert back to allow changes. That's it. That is a way to keep a thief or someone who finds your phone from accessing your Apple account and locking you out of it. Don't wait. If you have an iPhone, do these settings right now. In the description below, you can click and download a PDF version of the steps to do this. Please, don't wait. Do it now. Thanks for watching our video and have a great day.